What's he doing in there? Well, he's got some good stuff. Tetracycline, we don't need that. What's that there? That's more, isn't it? Painkillers, I'm not taking that either. Where are those shots? At the castle, maybe? I wonder if we should not do this, but it didn't. I don't know the sounds of the guns well enough. Still, uh, that didn't sound that juicy to me. It sounded quite weak. I'm thinking SMG, weak SMG as well, maybe. I don't, I don't know that. So, but I kind of fancy we might be able to take them on. It's probably at the castle though. So unless there's a base there, which there could be, they're probably just shooting wolves or zombies, and they're going to be not there by the time we get there. Might be Berezino. The server might restart in 10 minutes actually. I'm a, I'm a, I've just realised it's 10. I don't think I can make it in 10 minutes. How far to the castle? Uh, five minutes would probably be an understatement, but we can probably. Oh, there you can, you can see it there. Look, we can just head straight to it. I'm going to go straight to it, star it, starving, but I'm, I'm not convinced I can make it in five minutes. In fact, it looks like my character stripped bare, so someone's looted it. Oh no, it might be a graphical bug. Hello? Don't shoot. Hello? I'm a new spawn dude. Hello? No, it's not the running man. Oh my god. Where are you? Not the running man. What the fuck is going Where on here? You, Where are you? Where are you? I'm here. We're, we're, uh, we're not going to kill you. We're not going to kill you. We've is this your base? Four, like, four years ago. No, it's not our base. We just killed like six people here. Yeah, one of them was me though. I, I came up with a shotgun not knowing there was anybody here. This guy on the stairs, this oh. is me. This one. I'm sorry. Did I actually hit either of you two? I think it was you. Yeah, you took uh, you took my friend down to half. Okay. I barely saw you. That was insane. Do you mind if I loot my old body? Is that alright? Yeah, you can take all the stuff. We're, we're going to leave. We'll, I'll leave some uh, food here as well. Alright, dude. Thank you. Well, GG, it looks like you've been having some fun. Fucking hell. Yeah, we basically logged in after not playing for two weeks, spawned on the roof, ran down, saw three guys at the bottom of the stairs and just killed them all. Okay, and then people kept coming in. Well, they'll all be coming back any second, so I better get a wriggle on. Yeah, I'll leave your stuff here. You can take some stuff there. Oh, thanks, dude. I need a bag that's not ruined. They're all fucking ruined. Oh. 
So they may have only let me live because they recognise my voice, but there's really very little I can do about that. You know, I'm not looking to team up with them, and nor are they me, but uh, there's very little I can do about that. It sounded like I'd teamed up with one of them before from what he was saying, but uh, it kind of is what it is. And that can happen, you know, obviously it's easier for me, but I, from what I, I think he said he, he teamed up with me four years ago or something, you know. The reality is, obviously my voice is kind of recognisable, but uh, if in that circumstance I'd spoken and I'd teamed up with him years ago, he might recognise my voice too, you know. It does it does work that way, so I think I've got to just take that and uh, carry on, really. I don't see a great deal of other choices. Trying to slow people down that come this way. Sounds to me like they got pretty lucky. As in, look it in above somebody. They've even got a wolf there as well. So I'm taking loads of bandages because I want to do a gas route if I can. I want to go to the gas zone. That's my plan. I think an SKS is a decent start. I, it was almost worth the death to run back and get it, but... I don't know what condition my, uh, my vest was here. Was it ruined? Yeah. One of the biggest frustrations is probably that we, uh... We've lost the vest, and, but more importantly than that, I've lost the blood. The blood was really useful. I'm going to drop that, and I'm going to take... There's 60 M4 bullets, and I think that's worth it. Because if we go to the thing and we manage to get there, we may want the M4 bullets. That would be kind of cool. Right, I think that'll do. So, Glow, yeah, I've, I have talked about it a few times, but I'm picking up the bandage with bandages on purpose. I've got a little bit of a plan, so... I am uh, wanting to go to uh, Riffy. I'm going to have to go back to the medical and hope to find a bandage as well. I don't, I don't know why I picked that up. I'm wanting to go back to Riffy and uh, try and do the gas route. So I've got NBC gloves and a jacket and a gas mask. Uh, and so the bandages are so I can... I, I probably have got more than I need. I, probably pr I could probably do with about six, but uh, I'm probably carrying one or two more than I should be. But to ride out the gas zone, you need a blood bag to, to fix yourself, or a pox. But you also need a lot of bandages, because you're going ban to bleed every 15 seconds. That's an SKS, I think. The shot was in a house as well. They could even be in the hospital. There's a guy there. He just went running the other side of that wall. I don't think he's the shooter. I think he's the one being shot at. That's a shame. That could be the only NBC that we find. A new bandage? We could do with a new bandage. I've used a segment of one of the bandages. I don't want any part of that. I, I, I want to do the gas route more than I want to kill them. They're not in the house. They're just... Oh. They are in the house, I think.
They're in that house, shooting out. Oh, there's a base that's just opened. Oh my god, that guy is geared. I really, I really don't want to be any part of this. I just, this is really, this is really shit. I can't resist it. I can't resist it. So there's at least two players in the base. And there's someone suppressed shooting behind. I feel like the two inside are probably looking for the suppressed guy. They might all be together. I've got to go. I think we've got to go. If I stay, I'm going to get killed by the suppressed guy. I'm getting killed any second if I stay here. Oh, I definitely hit him. I just didn't drop him. I think we're going to leave that for now. And we're going to come back. This guy... Oh, that zombie I thought was aggroed. I think we're going to come back for that. That base is still going to be there, but it'll be a lot better for us to come back to when we've got an M4. If we can get an M4. Maybe an AKM. I should think a pair of gloves, uh, sorry not a pair of gloves, I'm already wearing it, I should think a pair of boots and some other form of NBC is kind of likely. We've got the fire station and the uh, fire station and the medical. I, I think there's a chance we'll get a bit more NBC as well. It would be cool to find an another one or two and it would make a hell of a difference but we're probably doing pretty well to have gloves, a gas mask, two filters and uh, Trousers and pants, to be honest, we're probably doing okay. There was a new pair of gloves at the hospital, but I think I'm I can't really go back there now, can I? We can find a blood big kit that will be uh, useful. The blood bag kit will make that really useful because we like I was saying before without a blood bag I'm not convinced I can do it. We may end up going back to the northeast airfield which I really don't want to do. has been looted quite a lot already unfortunately it looks like it's going to be cleared out there's a clinic clinic in Solnichi. yeah it's not really the best place for me to go though lots of new spawn same as Berezino but Solnichi's a long way the wrong way you know like if I go to the northeast airfield again it's much closer to Riffy than Solnichi is so I don't think that's the place to go I didn't I don't really want to go back to the northeast airfield. And we have found a few bits of NBC here, haven't we? But just been a bit unlucky in what we've found. And I've got an hour and forty minutes, but to be honest, I, I my gut feeling is that if that's it, I might go back and try and have a go at those guys in the base and just just leave it. I might uh I might stash my, my stuff in the bag so we can have a go if I die. So 
So four, five, six, seven bandages, two EpiPens, and as much MBC loot as I can fit in there. I also need that in there really as well, but I can't. I ain't gonna fit that in there. I think we're going to be dead soon. I think there's about three players doing this. I don't think it's just one. I think the suppressed one was firing from beyond the... Uh, came from behind me unfortunately I fell forwards that sucks so you came from somewhere near the green tent <sighs> fucking base builders in Berezino sucks doesn't it this is Berezino though he could have been in the hospital you know Oh, he shot the fucking gun. I would do a similar sort of thing though in Berezino because it works. It, 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 it stops me getting it. It makes me feel shit right now because he shot my gun, but... It's a legit tactic. It can makes complete sense. I never did drop the NBC gloves off, so it's probably just as well that we... These guys are fucking hardcore, aren't they? Maybe it wasn't a wise move to drop the gloves where I was in, on show, but I thought it, I might as well drop them. To be honest, once you've set up a base there, you're going to get shot by everyone. You're going to shoot everyone. I think that's why you do it. That's just part of the game, dude. These guys, are, I, they've just been shot at by me in the past, to be fair to them as well, but not that they knew it was me. I was a new spawn. Uh... But if you build a base in the middle of Berezino, you're building it to kill people. You can't be, you can't be building a base there to be friendly. You know, like anyone that's around is someone you just killed. Chances are, you know, like, find me. They're, they're not going to be friendly to me. It's just not the way it goes. You know, if you walk up to someone's base in Berezino and expect handouts, you're probably not going to get so far. You know. Uh, it, it's part of the dynamic of the game that if they're geared and in Berezino chances are they're gonna fucking shoot you this is uh, Cherno oh no it's not I nearly it, well, I thought it was Cherno this is Berezino that's good I thought it was Cherno it's easily done there but the angle of the docks you, I rarely get that spawn but this is good it's whether I go back for the NBC gloves or not. I think I might quickly check the fire station and the uh, check the fire station and the medical again. Maybe we'll get lucky on a new spawn of NBC. That zombie's got a stab vest. We'll go and get that in a minute.
I'll tell you what sucks that I actually lost. I lost the S I lost the PU scope. That's kind of annoying. Right, I don't need those. I don't need that. I've got trousers and a jacket stashed. See, new stuff has spawned in. It looks like they're all EpiPens, though, but... God, they really are all EpiPens. Fucking hell. Jesus Christ! I think the server might have an issue. Well, not the server. It's just the way the game is, right? But it is a little bit mad that how the the loot economy works. It just it needs to put epipens in, so it puts like eight of them in the same building. Still don't need the pants. Take those pants. It gives more space. Oh, fuck off. I best fix the bleed, but we'll better wait till we get in here. Hello, oh, man. Hello? How are you? Can you help me? What's up? Lots of zombies outside. Can you help me? Yeah, I can try, dude. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. I, I just need to check for a jacket and then I'll be there. I thought I could go up there. And the zombies follow me, a set of bastards you. Yeah, I'm on my way, dude. I'll be there in a sec. I've definitely gone on that. How did I go on that then? I'm sure I've vaulted on that. Do you think I can jump into there? What about a safety measure? <coughs> yeah, safety net it is.
to be honest, I, I've got to be honest and, and be fair. When I kill somebody in a spawn town, I might throw their gun or I might shoot it to ruined, right? I, so I can do that. But if building your base in a spawn town and killing anybody either not geared or geared and ruining all the guns, I think that's just another level. You know, it's a level that frustrates me a bit, you know. I completely. If you're playing Essica and you kill someone in the spawn town, you don't want to leave any loot for them because they'll be back killing you with it in two minutes and you, you've just spawned in there, you know, you can't help it. But if you've built a base and you're camping the spawn town, to me that seems like even worse, you know. And, and maybe that's me being wrong, but I just... It, it, Fucking burns my blood. Hello. It's been about 20 minutes or so. I think it's time for a little tiny bit of narration. I hope you're all good. Thank you very much for checking out the video. If you're new to the channel or you're not subbed already, don't forget to hit the sub button. You're still watching after 20 odd minutes, so maybe it might be worth it. I don't know. Your choice. But please do if you do. Don't if you don't. That's not the reason I'm narrating, though. Hello, everyone. Thank you for coming in. Uh, this narration is just to save you about 20 minutes, half an hour of extra footage. So after I'd gone back and picked up those NBC gloves, I decided to go to Riffy Boat, which is a really good place to get epic loot like M4s and AKs. Unfortunately, I stayed in the gas zone too long, gave myself the gas illness, and that's a death sentence if you don't have a blood bag or a pox injector. Unfortunately, I had two blood bags on the first character, but he died at the castle, and so... Uh, what I'm doing now is stashing the loot and preparing to come back. So I know I'm dying, I stash the loot, and then I have the intention of coming back again on the next life to try again. So we're going to pick it up in a second on that. I've shown you quite a lot of the early stages of this, and I know I've died a few times, but the reason I wanted to share with this, this with you is to set this whole little series up. I was kind of, as you just heard there when I was saying it was burning my blood, <laughs> I was kind of a little bit angry <laughs> about the Berezino builders, you know, like, I, fair enough, I'm sure it was fun from them. If there was a big group, maybe there was like seven, eight or nine of them or something, building a base and having fun, uh, fair enough for them to be doing it, but it really does mess up other new spawns and other players and such like, so I kind of fancied having a dig at those guys, and this whole series is around that, so we're going to pick it up now as I'm spawning on the next character. I spawn in Solnichi, which we're there now, or getting there now. And we're going to pick it up as I adventure back to try and get some good gear and try and take some kind of revenge on those base builders. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. I'll catch you in part two, probably. Love you, bye. This is so niche. This might work. We can do the hospital here. Maybe our best bet, then, is to find NBC boots at the, uh, at the thingy. Finding NBC boots at the, at the hospital here would be good, wouldn't it? Hello. Hello? Hey. Holy shit. What up? You don't have any NBC boots okay. between you, do you? I need NBC boots. I'm a collector. Nah, unfortunately. Oh, that sucks. What about a pickaxe, a hoe, or a shovel? You ain't seen any of those, have you? I could spare you a gun. Oh, dude, well, I, I I can't dig a hole with the gun, but I wouldn't say no. Thank you. Oh, thanks very much. Oh, you're welcome, buddy. Appreciate it, dude. Thank you. You're welcome. Good luck. I'm going to the well. Yeah, you too, buddy. All right. You need something, too? What a nice guy. That looks like a good place for a melee, right? Can we ha can we have a hoe, please? Nope. No hoe for us. Find a BK though. Shit. 
Hello. Uh, yeah. You don't have a hoe, a pickaxe, or a shovel, do you? Uh, I don't. I'm just gonna come in. There's a lot of zombies out there. Uh, I don't even know if I have a knife. I don't. I don't. Sorry, I came out to kill the zombies. I'll be there in a sec. <laughs> or will I? <laughs> it's dark, isn't it? He's a nice guy and all, but I've only got like 20 minutes left, so what can I do in 20 minutes? I can't do anything, can I? <laughs> Not with a teammate, i just got to go on my own and try and get back to that NBC stuff. Hunting bag. <laughs> Struggling to see the zombies enough. How in the last shed? No. Did I check the last shed? I didn't I did completely missed it. Oh well spotted. I couldn't see that for love nor money. Oh my god. That's what we needed. That's the last bit we needed. could take the extra knife as well so i ain't got to worry about hydration so much anymore because we've got the uh we've got the cooking pot full of water and also more meds and shit i did have a ump there i, I don't know if i really want the ump or not if we can't get better than that then let's not bother So we've got full NBC, yes. I, pr I probably won't be able to do the NBC loot route, or the NBC looting today. To be honest, based on how shit the loot was in those containers, that might not be such a bad thing. It was terrible, wasn't it? So we found that wooden crate, and then we came this way. And at one of the trees over here, not these ones, a little bit further, there was a stash. An underground stash. Well, you never know what's going to be there. It's probably going to be dog shit. I think it was that tree there. Is it that tree? That tree. Come on then, what, what have you got for us? Give us some good, good stuff. Pox injector as well. Let's plant it somewhere where I'll never find it. Nobody's going to watch and steal this anyway, are they? That would just suck, right? No, Nobody would do that. Oh, 
Oh, you'll never find that. Nobody will see that in days, will they? No chance. It's in a little tree. Somewhere, somewhere. Done. You passed by a barrel, did I? the barrel was then. Oh, it doesn't matter. I ain't got fucking time for pissing around. We're going to go. So we've got the M4. We just need to get the bigger mag, which we'll get when we do the NBC loot next time. Hello? Fucking hell, man. Jesus. Scared the shit out of me. You alright, dude? You scared the shit out of me, too. Yeah. What are you after? What are you looking for? Are you looking for special loots? Why's your microphone stopped working? Ooh. Pressed, uh, I untabbed it. Um, you're running, man, Z, aren't you? I can tell by your voice. What? Running Pansy. Who's running Pansy? You're running. I know it's you. You don't have to pretend it's not you. I know you don't want dudes finding you. But what a crazy coincidence to find you here. Yeah. Basically, I came looking. There were a there were a a barrel in this tree or somewhere ages ago. Yep. So I came to see if it was still here. Basically. No, it's not. Also, hmm? there's a there's a castle far west near. Like Kmut, do you know the name of it? Kresnest Kresnestaff. No, uh, it's it's further west, it's like right uh far west. Uh-huh. Kmut maybe. No not not Kmut, it's got it's next to the railway. Oh yeah. The, I'm gonna stand in the street so we don't keep moving. Um there's a basically I got there with a mate the other day and it's really bad laggy, so there's a stash in it, so I went looking, I keep finding massive groups of people with like plate carriers and the big big gear. castle the one the one that's right yeah by the yeah, the one that's, yeah 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 um i keep going there and coming into contact with clan with a clan but i can't find where they're stashing it it's like they've got it underneath the map or something oh those evil bastards can mm. you actually do that though can you can they, can they put stashes like you shouldn't be able to no in I, the buildings i think in the past a few people have made made them in rocks and things but hopefully they get caught but no it, they'll probably be around the area somewhere you know they might be digging it uh, all I can't underground find them anywhere. well that's, that's what we're looking for but when we keep we keep going back and try to find it but every time we're there they turn up mm, i've yeah. killed two of them but my mate keeps dying and then i i die as well but it's not on a minute all right well uh good luck i've got to go um, this way all right do you need anything bro by the way if if i was the running pansy i'd probably call myself uh the running man's that's what I'd say. I'd pronounce it. Mans. The, yeah, I wouldn't it. pronounce it Man Z, you know, like otherwise that guy you yeah. mentioned would would be saying, Hi guys, this is the running Man Z. Thanks very much for checking out this video, wouldn't he, you know? But he hasn't ever said that, has well. he? <laughs> that's what I thought. I'm just I'm just starstruck man. I couldn't remember how Alright, well uh, good luck. When, to I re you. when I recognize it with your voice. Uh, Alright bro, take it easy. Nice to meet you. Take it easy man, have a good one. Love you bye.
Right, could do with another filter. We're going to have to try and kill some Zeds with the Makarov if I can. So I've got the M4 on me. It's badly damaged. I need a cleaning kit. We'll see how we go. Yesterday there was a whole load of junk in here. It's actually possibly useful. Yes, Val. Leave it for now. Oh, I've got it. I've still got it. Oh my god, my stamina's not coming back. That sucks. I didn't realise my EpiPen had... I didn't realise my EpiPen had ran out. That's not smart, is it? I had to get down and shut the door because they were all gone inside. Are you kidding me? Surely there's got to be a filter amongst these. Oh my god, that sucks. Yeah, that's not great either, is it? I think we're going to end up just using the M4 that we've got. I don't think we're going to find anything better. I bet there was other filters in some of the stashes as well. I probably should have done a, a bit of a better job at finding the finding the filters, but never mind. That's good. That's a suppressor for the M4. So this M4 I dug up out of a box yesterday. Right, bye bye VAS Val then. The AKM is probably the good gun. It's normally AKM or M4, it's rarely both. Raincoat, that's the kind of loot you want to find on the way out, isn't it? Ooh. I don't like that site, we'll leave it. <coughs> so now we've got to go off with our BK18 and try and find uh, mags for M4s and AKs. So I've got really good assault rifles, but no uh, no bullets, well, no mags. Yeah, I do have a suppressor for both. All right, there we go, that'll do. I wonder if on the way out we should maybe have a little look to see if there's any more buried loot. We found a couple of stashes yesterday and I, I, I've got a hole in my inventory. It's pretty clear that players are burying NBC loot and NBC, sorry, and M4s and the like around here. Let's just 
have a look, see if I, I found one here. That's where I, I dug up a stash myself yesterday. There's the barrels the dude was looking for. I think I've got enough, that'll do. So I think you guys saw that yesterday and I didn't see it. That's an improvised explosive. Oh my word. That's not just an improvised explosive, that's that's complete. With detonator and all. About to give up on looking for the underground stash as well. Oh wow! I think I've got to take that for now. It's kind of my best weapon, effectively, for now. Police car. Oh, this is a police convoy. Very cool. Pioneer, look at that, holy shit. With an ACOG scope. <gasps> wasn't there, oh no, wasn't there in one of the barrels, wasn't there a optical repair thing, wasn't there a electric repair kit? I think I've got to go back, that ACOG scope will... Oh, I need to go back and try and find one of that barrel. I don't even remember which one it was. I think it was somewhere around here. Oh, that bullet has not gone in my inventory from the Pioneer mag. I fucking hate that. Oh, how cool is that? So the ACOG scope that we got, we just got from that Pioneer can be repaired. So then we've got a, uh, a, a fully working ACOG scope with a... Uh that is cool. That is very, very cool. Now let's do that. So if we look at this down the scope right now, it should be cracked. Yep, all cracked. And you can invisible mend that. It's pretty obvious that it's easy to amend it with a couple of screwdrivers from an electrical repair kit. There we go, fixed. That is cool. Now we've got to try and go somewhere, get some big mags and... Uh, we can have an AK. We can have an M4 for long range with the ACOG, and we can have an AKM with the uh, with bullets and a mag and whatnot for close range. You know, we'll like, we'll keep them both. Why not? We're going to move it along many hours now in game. I travelled all the way across the map to Tissy Military Base, looted my way there, uh, went to Troitsky Military Base, uh, 
some summer camps and various other places. And I have got some magazines and some bullets for the AK and the M4 now. I've also got a chambered FNX, which is a suppressor, which I've been using for zombies. Uh, and I met Tissy just trying to get more bullets and grenades and things like that. Because I had a couple of targets in mind. I wanted to go to the castle that the guy that we met on the coast, the Running Man Z fan. <laughs> uh, I wanted to go to that castle and see if there was anybody there. He said he kept finding a clan there. So I wanted to go there. But I also wanted, if I could, to try and get back to the coast and go and see the Berezino base builders. So, yeah, we're going to pick it up while I'm looting Tissy military base. I'd really like to be done in Tissy before it goes dark. Oh my god. Randomly comes in. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Road, like all the zombies. They should de-aggro. I think I got the door closed, but I'm not sure if I'm through it or not. My god, that was tricky. Obviously my stamina being so low is a, a big problem. Even if I drop the AKM, it won't make sufficient difference to my stamina. It really won't. Right, that's the AKM gone. Is it really going to make a lot of difference? Not really. I probably could drop it, but I don't want to. Okay, this is definitely safe. So what do we want from the zombies? We need more bullets, maybe a mag. They do sometimes spawn with mags. But more importantly than that, we need uh, tack back. Or, bake, or, or, or bacon, or spaghetti is good too. Ah, oh, bollocks to that. I can't, I can't be bothered. I'd quite like to take the night vision cage, but it won't go on my head with this helmet, so... Right, the bacon it is no go, but the spaghetti is pretty good. It's the second prize. He's shooting Zeds at the base, I think. Jesus Christ, this is properly dark. I think he was shooting zombies. He's probably over at the barracks. Yeah, he is. That doesn't sound like shooting zombies. What the fuck is that? That sounds like bait all of a sudden.
don't think he's got night vision. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I nearly shit my pants. Fucking hell. My word. That is crazy. He's not actually, he's got loads of good gear, but he's, oh, he's got an armband. We should probably be a bit careful. He might have been using the silence glock, but maybe it jammed or maybe he got in some trouble and more zombies aggroed. He might have had more zombies than he felt. Like, 9mm is great for picking off Zeds one by one. But if you aggro alone, it's not so great. Jesus Christ, I can't see what I'm doing. Can you all just fuck off now? 11 bullets left. Let's just get into the forest a bit. <laughs> Jesus Christ almighty, this is tricky. Oh, I only hit him once. <laughs> Fuck me, GG. How good is that guy? That was great. How did he even hit me with the first shot? Well played to him.